Welcome back to my channel. I am back today with another video. And as you can tell, of course, by the title and the thumbnail, this is going to be about perfume. And we're going to do a little Amazon wig, y'all. So this is a wig I picked up a while ago, a long while ago. But anyway, we'll get into that later. But first half of this video is going to be about, like I said, Dossier. Um, I have done several videos on this company with their perfume. So yeah, I am a big fan of them. So anyway, before I even get too far, if you have not subscribed to the channel, definitely go ahead and subscribe. This is mostly a hair channel, but I do add a lot of, not a lot, but enough, several different types of videos, content on this channel too. So anyway, let's just jump into what Dossier is all about. I'm gonna give you a little rough draft of what the company is all about. And Dossier sells replicas of high-end perfumes Starting price is $29 up to $49, which is very, very affordable, y'all. Yeah, you can also get sales if you buy three or more bottles, free shipping, all that stuff comes with it, y'all. But anyway, so if you do get some perfume that you are not a fan of, you can return it free of charge. So basically, it's a win-win for us if we decide to go and shop with Dossier. You can get all of your money back and just, of course, send the bottle back. So first of all, let's just jump into the fragrances that I have. I can't even say fragrance. Fragrances that I have. So luckily, I don't even know how this happened, a miracle. I was shopping online and I did get a sample of one of the fragrances that I picked up from Dossier. So um, this one right here, the one that I'm gonna show y'all right now is called Musky Musk. Just in case, like I said, y'all have not seen the packaging for Dossier, this is the box that it comes in. You do get a card and it tells you the name, the notes and everything that this fragrance is all about. And of course, the scent that it is inspired by. This one is inspired by Juliet Has a Gun. So let's first bring this right here. Of course, if you haven't heard also, this is a 50 milliliter bottle. So we get a lot of perfume in these bottles. I am gonna spray this one, this scent on the card. I am gonna let it set. And of course, um, maybe I just go ahead and spray this sample on my wrist, on the other wrist. So while that is sitting, we are gonna go over this one. This one is called Floral Lavender. It's inspired by YSL Libre and it's a man's scent, so maybe I'll get my husband involved on this one, y'all. Because I don't want to get these scents all mixed up, so I'm going to go ahead and spray it on the card. And I'm going to ask him to bring his wrist over here, and we're going to get his opinion at the end of the video. So, yeah, I'm going to spray right here first. So, I'm going to spray it on my husband, and he's going to get ah! He's going to give me the opinion. That's good oh, enough that's at the end of the video. So, anyway, let's get into Ooh. the wig review, y'all. Sunlight that always stays Dinner by the waterway it's that sweet life Raise your cross Made some dude crack a smile He asked if I could stay a while I'm living that high life Time to catch a flight but you can make me go Unlocking all the memories of my new home Okay, this is what it's looking like Straight on, nothing done to it Um I don't know y'all, the way she's fitting right now, let me give y'all a close up. This is what it's looking like. My edges are peeping out just a little bit. I don't think that it's like super big head, but because of this style, it doesn't really matter in my opinion. So yeah, this is what it's looking like. And of course we got bangs. So this is gonna be a plop and go for the most part. This is what the top of the wig is looking like. No part in space, but you don't need one. And of course, I did show y'all the inside of the wig. And we don't have any combs in the back. We only have one in the front. I never used the combs, y'all, because I felt like the combs were doing damage to my edges. And I'm trying to save my edges. So 
yeah we don't i don't want to lose my hair for a wig but i'm gonna just go ahead and fluff it out and see what i can do i never dated a black guy i said you brown yourself let me offer help i have to be honest with y'all i have done a few videos on these type of wigs and I'm, i don't think i like myself in these type of hairstyles i think a lot of people look amazing in this these type of styles. I'm gonna put a picture of one of them that I did. I feel like uh, Ronald McDonald in Ronald McDonald in that wig, and especially because it was like a copper color. So I'm not a fan of that one because of the color. Reason why I went back and I picked a black one, and y'all, I still feel the same way. I think it's super cute on most people. I do like the curls on these. On this one right here, it's super uniform. So I think if I was really going to wear it out, I probably would have took a pic to it and kind of made it just a little bit frizzy, a little bit messy. Um, yeah, but overall the wig is cute. This wig right here is very, very affordable. I only paid $22.99. So anyway, y'all, y'all let me know what y'all think about these type of hairstyles. Um, like I said, it's okay on me. I'm not a big fan of them, but you might like it. So anyway, let's talk about the perfume. So. We're going to talk about Musky Musk. So the retail price for this one is only $29. And I am a fan of it. It smells really, really good. It definitely does smell a lot like the Inspired Perfume Juliet has a gun. So I would say this is a go for me. For the brand name, you are going to have to pay $100. So if you are looking for a replica of that one, I would say go ahead and try it. Cause this one does smell like it. So if you know that you like that one, I would say go ahead and try it. So let's talk about the other one. I have to get my husband in here to give me his opinion. Okay, so on the site, it's only $29 on Dossier's site. So if you want the original, you are gonna have to pay $112. So I think this smells really, really good on a card. Let me get my husband's opinion. Mm, it, smells it smells like pretty good, y'all. It actually smells like, like if you had to put a, Pineapple. It says lavender, so lavender is supposed Ooh, to be in here. It does. Um, it's, it smells like the really, really good washing detergent. Okay, so that's his opinion, y'all. I think like, it smells good. You smell like it got it fresh cologne. It smells clothes, like though. men's cologne. I do like it, so it smells yeah. like a snuggle dryer sheet. <laughs> so anyway, you got his opinion, y'all. So I do think it smells good. Definitely smells manly, and if you're interested in that one, I think it's a go also for me. Again, I have not smelled the original one. I don't think my husband has either, but um, he likes it, so I it's a go. It. So anyway, y'all, I'm going to go ahead and end this video. Please like, subscribe, of course, comment. Let me know what y'all think. Have y'all ever tried Dossier? I highly recommend that you do if you haven't. I have a good bit of their colognes, and I am a fan. If you have not checked out the company, definitely go ahead and check it out. And yeah, I'm going to go ahead and end this video and I will see y'all in my next one.